and also i had to i had to bring in i had to bring in a friend to help me um get better uh get better artistry skills i've seen this dude online i've seen this dude online i think he's all right at uh he's okay at drawing and painting and stuff you know but i think he can help me um get better at this art stuff like i think maybe like one or two maybe like a video from him i can definitely draw better monkeys all right let's go oh wait one sec shoot Ligma is the 18th letter of the Greek alphabet. It's next to... <laughs> it's next to Fugba and Sugba. Do they have... Do they, do they have that at a, at, a, at a university? Like the fraternity, like... Sugma... <laughs> Sigma, Sugma, Ligma? Educate yourself, nerd. Oh, shoot. It's getting hostile in chat. All right. I need, to, I need to learn. I would be in that frat. I would, I would try. I would try to get into that. That'd be pretty cool. I'm back. Certainly glad you could join us today. I thought today we'd do a painting that's just very pretty to make you feel good inside. So let's start out and have them run all the colors across the screen that you need to paint. All right, I got this. white. While they're doing that, let me you show got you. blue. Yeah, I think that blue works. So what we got up here. I have my standard old 18 by 24 inch double prime canvas. Night but black. Okay, I think I think I got some. Yeah, I have a black one. Whatever size is convenient for you. I've just Dark Sienna. I think it's I think it's this one. I think it's this one. I think it's whatever this is. As I look to this, because I think this one's Van Dyke Brown. Shoot, they look the same. Oh, shoot. Oh, wait, no, they're a little different. Okay. Covered the entire canvas with a very, very thin... Oh, man, I'm going to make the best monkeys so after this. Oh, this will be so good. Gotcha. Crimson. Alzarian Crimson. I like a redder red. I like the reddest red. Yeah, let me see. I'm gonna make like a red red. Oh, I like that red. Wait, no, I messed it up. Hold on. You can't see it, but I'm on the custom colors. I need to make another red. I think that's crimson enough. That looks no different from this one, but it's fine. Crimson. Sure. Yeah, yeah, that works. Yeah. Just have some fun today. Maybe we'll start out with Change your category to art. Oh shoot, yeah, you're right, huh? Y'all do that right now. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Yeah, I think that worked. Yeah, I think that works. Okay. Sap green. I got green. Brush. Into that. That's we'll good enough. A little bit of Indian yellow. Cadmium yellow. I think I got like mustard yellow. I got like orange too. Leonardo DiCaprio up in here. Yeah, he's he's quite the it's quite the artiste, right? He isn't he the guy that like 
he painted the Mona Lisa on the Titanic, like Mona Lisa 2 on the Titanic. Is that what he did? I actually want to look up <laughs> cadmium yellow. I want to make sure I, I'm not missing any colors. Oh, shoot. Scuffed. I forgot I can't use arrow keys. Scuff stream. Like y'all saw anything anyways. It's all good. Eyes hair yellow. I thought it was like I thought it was like Joker. I thought it was like Joker Green with the the skins you keep using. I mean, it is it is mustard yellow. Ah, whatever. See, these art people using their names for for colors. Oh, just a small amount. Don't need much. Thought we just yellow oak. Oh man, I don't think I have that one though. Oh, it's okay. That one's like Dijon mustard yellow. Okay. I need that one though. The Dijon. Uh, yeah, that's good. <laughs> oh man. Let's just do something that's bright and shiny and pretty. And as I say, it'll make you. How many yellows? Oh man, that's a lot of yellows. Oh man. Just set this up earlier. Kinda like orange. I'll use orange. I'll use orange. I'll just use orange. Why not? You feel good inside. Indian yellow. Alright, we just put a little yellow right. Oh shoot, he's starting. Bright red. Right there. Something about like that. Where's he putting that? Just there in the middle? All in the middle? Without cleaning the It's gonna put it all in the middle. That looks like the okay, I gotta go back a bit. With a little tiny two inch brush. And to that we'll add a little bit of Indian yellow. Okay, the Indian yellow. I think it's this one. <laughs> oh man. Oh, this is gonna be great. This is gonna be great. She's in the spray can. Amount. Don't need much. Thought we just let's just do something that's bright and shiny and pretty. And as I say, it'll make you feel good inside. All right, we we'll just put a little. Make me feel good inside. Just put it all in the middle right here. Put it all in the middle. Yeah. Yeah, you just gotta. Introduce, introduce the paint to the canvas. Kind of give it a little hello. Make it all bright and shiny with this Indian yellow. Man, once once I'm I'm gonna make good monkeys and I'm gonna get his impression down. The yellow, right telling there. you something about like that. There okay, that is go. all. Okay. Without cleaning the brush, I'm gonna go right in too. Oh my ochre. god, he didn't even clean the brush. Yellow ochre. It's sort of a gold color. My my yellow ochre aka orange. That look any different? Okay. A little different. It's very nice. Warm color. Very nice. I like that too. There. I can make a little person. Big smiley face on there. We'd have somebody's portrait right there. Oh, he agrees. He agrees it doesn't look like a person. Here we go. Let's just blend that together. I can't blend it. It's Maybe fine. More of the ochre. <laughs> blend it out. Mm, oh, more of the ochre. Like okay. We don't care. Dead oh man, we're like layering it. It's pretty cool. As you know, we don't make mistakes. We just have happy accidents here on canvas. Happy accidents. Okay. That's like his line. That's like his catchphrase. Can we wash our brushes since these are oil paints with odorless? Paint. Like when he wins like a smash tournament, he's like happy accidents. They happen. And just 
cover everything in about a block radius. Oh man, I got he covered like all of it. Oh man. Oh, let's take. Let's take. What are we taking? Blue. I'm gonna make a pretty blue. Good oh shoot, and he's getting crazy. Crimson. Just mix it together. Oh, and he's blue. mixing colors. Oh no. Proportionately. He's making like purple much, though. I could do that. Much more crimson than blue. I want to add a little more to the center. I want to add a little more of this. There we go. We just make a nice lavender. Add a color. little more of this. About like that. Okay, good. Now you may want to put a little white over here and test it to see what color it is because it just sort of looks black on the palette. And you might want to test it. I like his voice. All right, I'm going to put a little bit of this on my two inch brush. Ooh, really solid voice. And then we'll start on the outside edge. Oh, titanium white. Just begin blending that in. I don't want to. I don't oh, want okay. dark color here. Just a little lavender. A little lavender. Just to bring a little lavender. Again. That's a lot of lavender for me. Today that's just very bright and sparkly. Maybe, oh, that's actually a good bit of lavender. It has an autumn feel to it. What the heck? There we go. I'm gonna put a little bit on the other side over here too. We don't want him left out. Yeah, I should add like. There. I feel like I should add a little more yellow just to the sides. Or in the middle. Okay. Beat the brush. <laughs> Beat the brush, Cornelius. <laughs> and that's about all we're looking for. I can imagine like a drill sergeant, Bob Ross, behind me. Beat the brush. Beat the brush, Cornelius. Titanium white. You're not beating hard enough, Bree. <laughs> that doesn't sound right. Oh, I, oh, I, I need it. I, I feel like this needs to be bigger in the center. This needs to be bigger. My mind is horrible. Gotta add more. Gotta get bigger. I gotta make it very big. All just happy accidents. Is this the color? Yeah, it's this one. Really? This is either going to look like an amazing nature piece or I'm going to be able to sell for like 50k at like the abstract abstract art auction. I'm telling you. I think that's yeah. Add a little more to the center again. Just a little more, a little bit. Out here. Yeah. Yeah, beat the brush. Yeah, beat it. Yeah. Get it all over there. What are you guys saying? You better beat a boy. <laughs> Pixel Bob. I've never seen that. <laughs> Is this an IRL drawing? I can't. I don't know how to change the tags. I'm so I'm so working on it. I like your voice. I like Bob Ross. I like Bob Ross's voice. But thank you, way. Gotta go. I need a. He, I, I feel like he made it like super big. I'm not trying to bite on him or anything. I just wanna. I just wanna be like Bob Ross and make make super cool monkeys. You know. Like once I'm done with this, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna make some dope monkeys. Wrong one. All right, all right. Got to get the middle right here a little bit more. I feel like he made it. I made it way smaller than he did. Okay, okay. I'm a little purple because the purple looks nice. That purple looks so nice. Now I'm, I'll continue with him. What's he doing? A little white and begin blending outward. I want this to be very bright right in here. Oh man, he's blending. So take what do I do? Titanium white and just really work it in there and work outward. Once you get the brush contaminated with color, contaminated with color, to take it back into the center. Back into the center. You can do this as many times as you want to achieve many times as you want. any desired lightness. Any desired lightness. But I would suggest that you. Is MS Paint too advanced, or not too advanced? Is it too simple for like a blend? What if I just like? If I just like. Cause I know he's doing like the middle. 
How about I just like... This is how you blend, you just put color. Or no color in the middle, here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm literally just like erasing the middle. Oh man. Is there a brush? Yeah, yeah, it kind of is. Oh, wait a minute. I know there's like a... Oh, wait, what about the marker? <laughs> the marker is so big. If I do the marker... Because the marker isn't like completely solid. To see that you can kind of see some yellow behind it. It's not like completely white. I kind of like that, yeah. <laughs> that does not look correct though. Oh well. Clean the brush each time. You go My canvas is MS Paint, and nothing yeah, will change that. Drag it. Not even, <laughs> not even like the it. lack of not being able to blend. Yeah, we can take it very lightly. Just blend the entire canvas. How did you do that? You just sort of bring that it. That looks so nice. That easy. There. That'll sort of give us a nice warmish glow right out there. This man's a genius. Yeah, then well, I got that old brush going. Oh, I forgot to do this side. It has lavender on it. We'll use that. Get away from me, Bob. I'm a little slow. Can't beat the brush as fast as you can. Oh man. Oh, it's purple. Little. Looks like a little like a. Kind of like a morning sunrise or something like that. I don't know. Got to add so much more purple. Did I? What if I make <laughs> a little, little bigger size? What if that works? I'm here for the legend. Crow. Bro, I'm going to I'm going to make the best monkey after this. You got to watch. First, I I need to learn once I steal Bob Ross's techniques, I can draw like the best monkeys ever. I'm telling you. This that's what this whole stream has led up. My my failing of trying to my failings of the presentation has led me to to believe that my my purpose for this stream was to draw the best monkey. I'm pretty sure. That's what I had to do. Just gotta, just gotta blend it. Just gotta blend it better. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the white marker in the middle looks so. Let's put a little bit of that lavender color right on the brush. Just tap having to cover around lessons. the brush. And maybe. Maybe in our world, back in here, I don't know. Just start making decisions here. Maybe there's some little things that live back in here, wherever. We're oh. just going to make some little background indications, things that live far away. There. Like that. As you run out of paint, just turn the brush over. Use the other side. Either side. There we go. I got to, like, just click really fast. Indications. I don't know exactly what they are, and I don't know that we really care at this point. Just by you can kind of see that. Here, let me see. Is there like a... Make that a little a little darker. A little darker color. Yeah. yeah. Add custom. There we go. There we go. A little... Oh, now you can now you can see that stuff lives, lives all the way in the background over there. Like little mountains or something. Like little purpley mountains. Yeah. What does this even look like on the stream? Oh man. It looks like something. 50k auction house go. Lowest bid. <laughs> this is definitely not crow. This looks like the sun wearing a wig. I think that would be a good abstract art like title too. Sun wearing wig. That that's immediately like twenty more K right there. So I guess this is like seventy K piece right now. 
Just because I called his son wearing wig. Like immediate. Sometimes you can take media plus. To hold it vertically and put in all kinds of little indications. Little indications. Little Forever. indications. Once again, this is just background material. We're not really concerned with it at this point. Okay. Maybe later on we will be. But right now, it's just background material. It's just background material. As you begin running out of paint, you can put things that are closer. I'm to never running out of paint because I'm using MS Paint. Lighter. MS Paint's infinite. There we go. Just little, little hints. Kind of just of things that you can see back here. We don't know where they are. Very quiet little, little. little well, maybe I shouldn't things. just try to copy them. Maybe I should just like. See, it gives the impression there's things back. Bob here. Ross is teaching me right now. This is my painting. This is my. This is my 70k abstract painting. I'm gonna sell in the auction house, and people will be like, "Oh shit." This is fucking subtle with a wig. Fucking 100k. Or little things that hang out over here. 100k. Immediate 100k. Wherever you want them. Wherever I want them. Thanks, Bob. There. Yeah. Thanks, Just Bob. All kinds of little doers. Little doers. Little doers. <laughs> little doers. Mm. A little darker purple. Let me get a little yeah, darker little purple. Painted already. At the custom. That's all it takes. Yep. It's really all it takes. You know, just let your imagination take you to anywhere that you want to go. I'm just repeating everything he says, but it's like it's hard not to. He has a really good voice. Now we can come back and begin making the indication. Is that even darker layers. purple? I gotta make it darker. Do the darker do the purple. That in your Super mind, purple. Others to wave first, and then work forward. I'm running out of custom colors. We'll create depth, even in little background things like this. And chances are we'll cover most of it up, but some of them may show through. And people will think that you worked for long periods of time to create these illusions. Shh, it's our secret. Don't tell. Okay. Just enjoy. See, our little, just our little secret. Our little secret, Bob. There. We're all trickers. There. We're all trickery. Masters of paint illusion. See, 200k on the auction the house. Someone with a hat. I really oh, like that. Like <laughs> I really. Someone with a wig. I really like that for some reason. We really have we haven't done hardly a thing. Maybe we'll have a little water. We <laughs> it's too perfect a replica. We'll decide where the water lives later. But we'll have a little bit in there if we need it. I'm yeah, this is blue. one to one. A little blue. If Bob Ross were here, he'd shit his pants. He'd be like, that's 500k on the auction house. Auction house. Auction house. It's mostly lavender. It's just more of a blue side now. How does he do that? Whoa. Let's see. Well, I gotta catch up to him. White on it. I gotta catch up to him. <laughs> and I really like that. It's kind of like drag my mouse everywhere. How did... Man, I don't get how people do that. Just They just... One day they're just like... I gotta be a master beater of the paintbrush. Can't be a master beater. I wanna be a brush beater. And then they make like the dopest, the dopest landscaping portraits and stuff. He's also extremely fast at beating the brush, like... This time in his paint stuff, it's like clickety clickety clickety. I wonder if that's getting picked up on the mic, actually. <laughs> they wake up wanting to be a master beater. Lamb's loss is correct. Beat, 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 beat. Happy little accidents. See, I was, 
I was beating the purple on too hard that I didn't even notice that he put all that blue under there. Like a baby blue. I actually really like the spray can tool on this. Because like the regular brush on MS Paint is just so... Uh, so uh, I guess like the best word is like uniform. It's so uniform and like... Uh, I mean I guess it's good for like what... I don't, I don't know what to call it, like line, line art or whatever like that. Like m making like defined lines, but I really like, I just like the aesthetic of the brush, of like the, the spray can brush. Like how random it is. That's the sound, my, that's the sound of my paintbrush. I need to make the sound because it doesn't have it on MS Paint. Clickety ASMR, clickety, 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 brush, 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 500k at auction house, 500k at auction house, son with a wig, son with a wig. I'm gonna keep saying that until it's not funny, to me at least, I still think it's hilarious. 800k at the auction house, son on a wig. Might be too much blue, but I don't. Uh, it's happy accident. It's happy accident. It's just titanium white. Titanium white. Well, it's right there. Right. You get my. Maybe the lights zinging right across the water. The marker. I want that to be nice and shiny. Okay. Nice and shiny. Brush with the lavender. I'm just sort of. Nice and shiny. And there. This. Maybe there's a happy little bush that lives. Right here. Happy little bush. Oh, he said it. He said it. He said it. It's right out like that. He said bush. He said happy little bush. There. Nine can't the oxen house. We'll pull a little reflection down for him. That easy. That easy. Oh, I like how smooth who knows, that looks. Who knows, who knows? Get crazy. Maybe over here. Maybe there's another little peninsula that comes out into the water. So it looks like that water's back behind there. Looks like the water's back behind there. Once again, just a little, a little reflection underneath by pulling straight down and then going across. And that's all. Ooh, that looks super smooth. I wonder how I'm going to do that. Hmm. Don't want to use the pencil. Wait, watercolor? <gasps> oh, we've evolved. Oh, we've evolved. Oh my god, I've never even used this. Oh, it's a little too dark though. Yeah, I gotta be careful. Oh my gosh. I gotta figure out how to use this correctly. Yeah. This looks super smooth, but I'm, I don't know if I want that. I don't know if I want that. This is, this is my little happy, this is my happy little accident. I like, I like doing like little, little dashes. I like doing little dashes. That looks alright. Looks good enough for MS Paint. Little dashes. Happy little dashes. Get that get that dark purple. Make a little blend in. Blend in with the happy little dashes. Says something about a penin something about a peninsula. Something about a peninsula. Get that, get that super dark. Yo, this is starting to look like something. Almost. I think. I think it looks like something. I don't know. I don't know yet. I don't even know how far. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm only like nine minutes into the video. So yeah, it's like a nine minute or something. Yeah, I kind of like it. There is to it. Take that knife. Oh, he also did it on this side, huh? Kind of forgot. <laughs> Whoops. Do it. All right. Yeah. Let's see. Let's 
see. I was about to say. I was about to say that the power I have over Bob Ross is that I have the undo button and that I can perfect my craft. But I think there might be something about them happy little accidents that just kind of makes makes Bob's paintings all natural and stuff like that, you know? Sometimes we need them little happy little actions to make something something look very nice. Uh, let's see here. More purple. <laughs> but dumps. I don't really. I think I'm almost at like maybe like one million at the auction house. But I still think it's maybe like only like 850k. A little bush right here. Maybe that's where the bush is going to be. Let's get a little, let's get a little tippy tap some more water on this area. Not too much. That might be a little too much. Oh well. It's fine. A bit of liquid white. Maybe we'll put the least little touch of bright red in, just enough to pink it up a little. Give it a little pinkish flavor. Pull it out flat, cut across. Let's do that slow so you can see it. Cut across. Let's go up in here. Then we can take, and we're there. I want that tool. Got a little just cut just tool. Kind of indication of just a little water line that lives right up in there. Oh, a little, little water like line. That. I don't want a real distinct one. Just. Just a hint. Oh, mine is not Just distinct at all. A hint of color, right in there, like so, like so. There we go. All right. Now already, look at the amount of depth and distances in that. Is that simple? Uh, yes. Just, uh, varying the depth. shades. Now you could even go in here and take your knife and cut in little sticks and twigs. Sometimes in between all these little areas. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if I'm cut out for this, Bob. No, don't worry, Cornelius. You'll figure it out. You'll make the best monkeys ever. You'll sell this painting for one million at the African house. You really think so? You really think so, Bob? I do think so, Corn the dog. We'll just keep using the old two-inch brush. It seems to be working pretty good. Thanks, Bob. Change my mind. Oh, we changed the mind. Oh shit. That's the beauty. Oh, I kind of see what he's doing. I'm gonna take a little round brush. Still going to that lavender color. Uh, put a little background tree. Background for a tree that lives right there. There, a little darker. Each layer gets a little bit darker. He has spoken. <laughs> All right. Now maybe this tree lives on this side of the water. Let's put a let's put a little tree trunk in there. For that. Man, I like I looked at all these colors, right? Like when we started. I was like, okay, I have all these colors, and then he starts pulling out all these purples from nowhere. I kind of wish, I kind of wish MS Paint could blend or something. That's okay, I'm gonna die with MS Paint. Uh, where'd that go? This one? That's even darker. Let's go. It's a good perp. I'm gonna take a little. Van Dyke brown dark sienna mixed together. Load the brush full of, of color, a lot of color. See, both sides. Now I'm going to take one side and just take it through a little bit of white. So I have white. light on one side, dark on the other. See? Oh, white. White, dark. Okay. Now we have to decide here's our light source right here. Uh -huh. So light's going to come from both directions. Okay. We need to keep both directions. Light. Keep the light side of this. To the left. Oh my god, it he's making a tree. Lighter. Didn't come out quite light enough. Shit. So that it shows up with it. Shit, he's making a tree. I'm gonna make a tree. I think this is the one time I have to use my, my pencils. Or the brush, at least. My tree, right? I'm gonna put it right here. Okay. 
Jalen. You need a little, <clears throat> a little, a little thicker, a little thicker brush, a little thicky. That's good. Let's do it again here. See? Oh, he's, then he's doing it. Oh. dark side both at once. Oh, yo. Works well. And maybe... Yeah, what the heck? I'm working so... It's working so well. Let's do it again. Okay. One more time. <laughs> <Give it a little. laughs> That's good. There. I see we had tree trunks. That easy. That easy. And let me find my little round. Maybe I'll use the papers for Let's go into Fine. a little bit of a little bit of yellow. A little bit of sap green. Maybe there's a little green still going on back here. We decided we'd have maybe a little autumn thing, but maybe it's <laughs> back here. This little small round brush does fantastic on trees like this. Oh, that looks so nice. This is what it's just wonderful for just wonderful i love it when the i love it when the like paint stacks on each other and like kind of like pops out a little jack frost may be doing his magic still looks it's like it's like that kind of texture that looks nice to touch Maybe he missed i don't know this one. that's just me okay but surely he will come back and get it there what it was what is still got a little color. what does chat say is paint nice to touch would, would you touch a one million dollar Painting called Sun with a Wig. And maybe. 20k a touch. Color. Maybe there's a little yellow ochre right here. Touch a bright red once in a while. Down in here. Holy shit, it's what? <laughs> oh no. Just would let it happen. I'm sorry, Marwasu. It'd be dry by then. A small amount of the liquid white. Because as you know, a thin paint will stick to a thick paint. So we're going to thin it down just a wee bit. I keep making these. I keep ma making these up branches and stuff, but he's still like coloring them. Yeah, maybe a little paint thinner would do better. Yes, that's much better. I'm looking for a lighter color, so I can go back and yeah, that's what I'm looking for right there. I want to highlight that a little bit. Just want to highlight it a little bit so it stands out. More. Oh, I like that. I like right. that. It looks good. I'm talking about his. Okay, now, mine's a little abstract. Let's see. Maybe over here on the other side. <laughs> There's a happy little bush. It. Yeah, happy little bush. There's over here on this side, more into the green hues. Just play with these colors, back and forth, forth and back. Enjoy. Yeah. Just enjoy. really and truly enjoy. That's what it's all about. Painting does nothing else for you. It should make you happy. Should make you happy. I think that pink. Okay, maybe there's another little bush right here in front of that one. Just work in layers, each layer. <laughs> I keep trying to, I keep trying to layer these correctly, but let's get crazy here. Ah, that's fine. I mean, I'm just having fun with it. This side too. While I got the old brush working, we'll put some right down there at the foots of them trees. Well, let me catch up to you. I think, I think you put a happy little bush over here. I want to put one too. If you didn't put a bush over here, that's fine. This is my new bush. Going to AWOL. Bush wall. That's a joke. Happy little bush. Who knows where they go? Maybe? Yeah. We'll just bring them together. Oh. Huh. Oh. Huh. Huh. Oh wait, wrong one. Dang, I didn't realize how low how low he put these trees. Oh man, I wasn't really paying attention to anything he was doing. Uh, where all that where all that greenery come? 
Where all that shrubbery come from? Oh man. It's okay though. I'm gonna sell this for like one two one point two mil at the auction house. Click, 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 click. All right. Happy little bush. That's another bush. Check out that bush over there. Look at all these bushes. Actually, kind of want to do that here. Maybe if I just like. Does it even look like anything? Doesn't. Oh, I kind of get it. I kind of. It's like leaves. This is just gonna be like these, like. Kind of looks like a spaceship or something. Just, just in this. This nice little scene. I'm definitely gonna cut the bottom off of this, later. <laughs> this painting so ends. Since you paint, you begin to see all these little flanks. Sorry, Bob. I don't have these painter eyes like you do. I need I need to acquire my painter eyes in order to see all these little bushes. Just waiting to be discovered. All those tiny little bushes that just hiding from me. Maybe there's a bush over here, all the way in the background. Maybe they're just. Maybe they're just popping out of the wild. I don't know. I don't know how bushes work. Maybe this one's just popping out of the wild. Maybe there's another happy little bush over here. Or maybe they're all just popping out of the water. They're all just happy little, happy little water bush, happy purple little water bushes going for 1.2 at the auction house. Just practice. Just practice. You'll learn to create as you paint. There we go. A little bit of, little bit of black right in there. Oh, and he's making all those bushes in the front. I didn't even notice that. His book... Oh, my gosh. I want to make a big bush like that, too. I want to make a big old bush. Maybe a little yellow. Maybe a little greener yellow. Yeah. Crazy little bush. Crazy bush all the way in the front. Look at that bush. The craziest bush ever. That bush. Click, click, click. A little bit more green on that bush. God, I'm gonna like I really want to re review all this audio and it's literally just gonna be making making Bob Ross impressions auction house and then literally just saying whatever I'm doing on screen this is gonna be amazing yeah darker green
Even darker, yeah. Got a triple bush. Get a triple bush going. Cornelius dog, I'm I'm proud of the triple bush you made. You little gold medal. That triple bush just it got you two hundred more K. It's one point four one point four million at the auction house you could sell this for. Sewn with a wig. Our color in here. I'm never I'm never gonna get I'm back. never gonna get tired of that. I'm a little Prussian blue. Prussian blue is much stronger than Playboy blue. I want the foreground to be darker. There. Yeah, then. Back to our little oval brush. Dip it into a Goes little down bit. a little bit. A little bit of a liquid white. Cover all this with purple. Fuck it. A little yellow ochre, a little cad yellow. Or even a little bright red. Just tap the brush. And we'll go back up in here. Oh, there's a little firecracker. Little firecracker. that lives there but just that easy Bob just Brown. that easy you're right Bob Ross this is just that easy and another one let's focus your chakras layers though try to I focus my chakras I can finish this group between each and every group there we are let's go there on the other side maybe yeah I have a little bush right here too I'll make more bushes. I'll make more happy little bushes. I can't. Just varying colors back and forth, forth and back. There we are. There's another one. Indian yeah, more bushes. Sometimes. A lizard crimson. Give me a little grass, too. Pixel. Gorgeous. Happy little grass. Too. Especially if you're doing fall pictures. Mm. There. Something like so. Little tippity taps. Whatever. Little tippity taps. Whatever. Tap it in. Go back to the old two inch brush. Get a birdie. We'll put a little color on it here. The same colors that we're using the reds and the yellows. All of those beautiful colors and some green. We'll come back in here and just begin tapping in the indication of some little grassy areas that live in here. The more you tap this, the more it picks up the lavender and blue color underneath, and it'll just fade away. If you want it distinct, tap it very few times. The more you tap it, once again, the more it'll pick up that color underneath and the darker it'll become. Use that knowledge to your advantage. There. Ah, oh, Bob Ross is... Okay. Bob man. Ross is a genius. This man is a genius. We'll use more of the dark color. We'll put the indication of maybe something that comes right down here. I'm going to add a little... Dark sienna, little brown in there. Very. There we go. Something about like so. That easy though. That's all it takes. Got to plant some 1.2 mil auction house grass right here. All right. Think about the lay of the land when you're putting these in. Okay. I got 350. Bravery time. I'm gonna take some midnight black some. Van Dyke Brown Dark Sienna. Just mix all three of these together. A lot of paint. A lot of paint. Bravery test. You ready for this? Maybe in our world there lives a big tree right there. Oh my God, that's a huge right tree. There. Where did that come from? Tree has a friend. Right there. Two of them. Oh my gosh, she's crazy. There we go. Looks like something. The like mad something genius. I shot out of when I was a kid. Got in a lot of trouble with them. Maybe on this side. <laughs> Here we go. Another big old tree. Don't let these big trees scare you. Just drop them in. It's Just drop them in. You can put a big tree. Yeah, I gotta drop in these big trees. I just want to finish this. Uh, my grass right here. I gotta. I gotta mow all this. One. There we go. Oh, this little grass. There we go. No grassy plains. This is peace solid. Sun with a wig. Yeah, I know, right? It's like, uh... It's probably at 1.8 mil right now in the auction house. I'd say so.
here. You gotta be brave. You gotta be brave. Big old tree. Big old tree. The crossing. All right, not that brave. Big old tree. Big old tree. Yeah. Big old tree. I get brave with it. Got to cover up the sun with these wacky, wacky old branches. The big old, big old brave old tree right here too. Yeah. Wherever you want it. Wherever you want it. Or you can put a little tree. Up to you. I can, I can, I can, I can put a little tree too? Oh my gosh. Oh my god, you're right. I can't put a little tree. Oh, look how tiny it is. Now then. Wait. Let's make several different oh, wait. kinds of trees. There we go. Just for oh, I like that. Let's say oh, I'm going to put an even tinier tree. A tinier tree. I'm going to put one right here. In it. That's a tiny a tree. Pain. Let's say this tree over here. Let's decide it's a birch tree. The birch? just want to show you how to make several trees here. Maybe this old birch tree lives right here. Just sort of I think around spray the pole. Uh, I know it no, spray can would not be good for this. Like that with a knife when you give it a little pull. Whale brush. There. Oh, oh my God. Why haven't I been using this one before? Birch. His friend will be too. Since they live right together here. Man, I really should have just looked at these different brushes. And you can put a little touch on the other side. I'm a fool. Remember where your lights come. I could have easily tripled this painting's value at the auction house. Another old tree. Let's take some. <laughs> Wait, <soon enough. laughs> maybe not. <laughs> maybe not. Hold on. And maybe this tree over here is. I gotta figure out how I want to do this. For this one. Yeah, I really should have looked at. Dang, why didn't I look at these brushes? What the crayon? What's crayon look like? Oh my god, maybe the crayon's what I need. Oh my god, the crayon. It was the crayon the whole time. It was the crayon. It's just touch. Touch. Let the tree take off what it wants. Give you back what's left. Just touch. And when this is dry, touch. you'll be able to actually feel the bark in this tree. Oh my god, feel the bark. That's what I'm talking about. Feel the paint bark for like 20k at the auction house. So just touch. Just touch. Like Take our liner brush, a little bit of thin paint, thinning it with paint thinner. And we'll just put the indication here and there of an old tree lever or two that lives out here. I don't know. Wherever you want them. Old little tree? Wherever you want them. I'm going to put some leaves up here if we have time, so it's all right. We don't care what's up here. Just the indication. A few of them will show. There. Maybe, maybe this little tree maybe got stomped on it. He's not doing so good. Maybe, maybe he died. Maybe that's all that's left. It's just a skeleton hanging out here. Oh, well, poor little tree. Little birch tree's got a few limbs too. He lived a full little tree laugh. Enjoying the sunshine. Now he's encapsulated in MS Paint. An MS Paint painting that's going to be sold for $2 million at the auction house. What a laugh. Let's go back to our little round brush. We'll just use some of that lavender brown color. Doesn't matter. Here we go. Dude, these branches let's remind just, me of Olimar. Let's just drop some Don't know why. leaves right up here on these. This little round brush, it didn't take too long to do that. In fact, I think I'll just close the whole top of this in. How do you that's do that? Interesting composition. Oh, I need the crayon again. What's a crayon? Crayon, 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 crayon. The only need is MS Paint. Like, 
sort of sort of low key for real, high key kind of for real, low key for sort of for to sort of for real. Kind of like this. This was fun making. This was fun making this. Definitely, definitely silent. Uh, not really much to talk about when I'm doing this, but I don't know. I got engrossed with just listening to the sounds of Bob Ross and his happy little trees. Then. And kind of just tippity tapping with my mouse on the canvas, making a 2.2 .2 mil painting for the auction house. Oh man. Yeah, I agree. There should be more. Anywhere you want them to be. You're right, Bob. Up to you. Up to you, maybe. Right in there, even. Can you? I think for this, I'm going to use. So Dang, I got to cover. Got to make sure to cover all this right here. All those green. Come on, come on, more green. Yeah. Beat that brush, Cornelius. We might have find trees. Gotta get this top right here. All right. Yeah, yeah, that's good. I just want to add some green. That's what I'm feeling right now. Green over here for some reason. I like that green. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, boop, boop. Yeah, he, he wanted to make some dead trees, but I don't know. I'm kind of feeling gr green on these trees. Just a little bit. Just a little tad. Maybe they are alive. Maybe in my, my MS Paint dimension, they're alive. It'll stand out. I'll make an orange color out of yellow and red. Nice. What is he doing? Nice orange color. Oh, he's adding orange to it. There. Oh, that looks nice. A little orange to it. Oh, that looks nice. That looks nice, Cornelius. Cornelius, once you're done with this, me, the real Bob Ross, and you, Cornelius, the dog, we're gonna make two million at the auction house. We're gonna be your millionaires. Some paint thinner to thin that down so it sticks. Got a lot of paint on here now. There we go. Whew, boy, that's dynamite. Bright rascal. Very That's good. dynamite. That's red, dynamite. Yellow. Ooh, I like it. I Let me like blend it a bit. Gorgeous. That's what I was looking for. That's what I was looking for. There. Once again, remember where your light's coming from. Work with both shapes and patterns. Shoot, I didn't even think about light. Oh, no. Things That's fine. Other one over here. We just use the same basic color. So I see Jack Frost has played through here. And it's starting to turn. Little tippity taps. Colors. Tap, tippy tap. I'm just looking for an excuse to use a lot of yellows and oranges because I like those colors. If you hang a painting like that in a room, it, it brightens the entire room. There. Those oranges are pretty nice. Out like so. And that's all it takes. That's all it takes. 
shoot, put some indication maybe of a few little things down here at the base of the tree. And with that, she says, I have a finished painting. I can take a little red, a little liner brush, make a quick little signature, and we'll be gone. Hope you've enjoyed this one. With that, we're going to call it done. Oh, what? Damn, I was ready to keep going. Here, maybe I want to add a little more to this. I kind of want to add a little more, like a little more green over here. I like what he did with like the green just kind of going off to the side. Who knows? This really, I don't really know where it's coming from, but it's going off to the side. Corn signature. I got, I got something better. I have something better in mind. You know what? I think that's good. You know, it's got character. I kind of like it. Maybe that here. Kind of want to make this tree branch a little, a little more present. But uh, other than that, kind of. For an MS Paint painting, with the help of Bob Ross, this looks passable. I forgot to just have a little twig sticking out right here. Maybe it's just, he's doing a little dance. A little twig doing a dance there. All right, let me save it. I like that. Oh yeah. You know what? Yeah, let me let me sign it. Cornelius Dog. Put it put over. Oh, you're not gonna be able to see it. I'll just put it right here. <laughs> just just in the grass. C D. Those aren't dots. Those are smudges. C D. There. Right there. Cornelius Dog. Is that me in the corner? No, yeah, that's me in the corner. My 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 corn cam has been on the whole time, didn't you know? All right. All right, I think I think we're finished here, but uh I want to add a couple more stuff. I want to add a little bit more. Ah, uh, what should I use? How does this look? Nope. Yes, we are using the brush. If I learned anything from Bob Ross today, is just it's just to say, fuck it, do whatever, do whatever with your painting. It's your, it's your, it's your painting. You can do whatever you want with it. All just happy, happy little monkey accidents. Look at that. See, that's a good monkey. Yeah, that's pretty good. Maybe have another one over here. Have a little happy little monkey right here too. Yeah. yeah, that's a good monkey. Drawing his body a bit.
I can barely see that one. <laughs> oh, it's being covered by Bob. <laughs> oh, sorry, Bob. You might have to go now. Thank you, Bob. Thanks for being. Thanks for being on Corn Dog Gaming, Bob, and helping me out with all this. This amazing painting that's gonna go for like three million on the auction house. This is it. This one. Bye, Bobby. Little monkey. Yeah, it's a monkey. That works. Yeah, little monkey. Maybe there's even like a happy little monkey playing in the playing in the water. Oh gee, that kind of looks like the Elmo, the Elmo meme. Happy little monkey. Here, then uh, yeah. Happy little monkey playing in the happy little water. It's nice. Nice little monkey. There we go. Big old tail. Where else can I put a monkey? I just get wild with it. I can get crazy. I can go insane with these monkeys. Maybe this one's just <laughs> he's hanging on backwards. Little monkey's hanging on hanging on backwards. That's a nice little monkey. Little furry ears. We have a happy little monkey back here. Tiny, tiny little happy monkey back here. You know? You can kind of, you kind of see him. He'd be like a little secret monkey. He, he blends in very well to that background. Not gonna lie. All right. Yeah. I like this. This is good. I think I, I think those are some solid monkeys. I, I think my favorite one's the water one. The one that's just chilling in there. He's having a good time. He's probably taking a bath or something. Little monkey bath. Saving that. All right. All right. I think I'm going to go get some water. And I'll be back in like a couple minutes. Yeah, that's a good idea. That's a good idea. Got to stay hydrated. I like these monkeys, though. And when I come back, yeah, when I come back, uh, I'm going to be playing a game.